starring Tom Cruise as Gene Forrester. Right. Okay. Perfect. Jack Black is Finny. What you doing there, pal? <laughs> Coming soon to a theater near you. Dude, what do you think he's looking at? Honestly, bro, I have no clue. That guy could be up to anything. Leper played by none other than Michael Sarah. Yo, 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 dude, he sees us, he sees us. What are we, what's he, oh, oh, he's running. Dude, this jump's gonna be awesome. Here we go. Three, two. But when worst comes to worst, will the friendship of two best friends remain? Or will it simply break apart? No pun intended. Dude, you all right? Yeah, yeah, man. Doc just said I have to take it easy for a bit. But don't worry. I'll be back to normal before you can say banana split. Right in half. Quite an injury for an accident, wouldn't you say, Gene? Find out at your local theater this summer. Executive producer Noah Thomas here. With the recent end of production to a separate piece and preparing for the film to go live in theaters this August, I felt I should offer a list of why we picked our actors. So, first on this list, Gene Forrester is being played by Tom Cruise. Now, as all of you guys know, Tom Cruise played Top Gun, and I just felt that his star role in Top Gun really kind of mirrored the image I had in my head of Gene Forrester. Just kind of a you know, iconic character. And so we just wanted to make sure he was in our film. Now next, Finney is played by Jack Black. And as you guys know, if you've read the novel, Finney is kind of, he's quite a goofball, I guess you could say. So we felt Jack Black would play this role amazingly. And he did, uh, as you guys will see in August. So Michael Sarah is playing Leopard. And now if you guys have ever seen Superbad, um, you guys would know Michael Sarah plays an amazing awkward character. So we just felt there's no better guy. We got to get Michael Sarah on the team. And he did an amazing performance. Now, last but not least, Jesse Eisenberg playing Brinker Hadley. Now, guys, Jesse Eisenberg has been in so many films. He's been in Rio, he's been in The Social Network, he's been in countless other films. But I really felt like his performance in The Social Network was perfect, perfectly matched with what we wanted Brinker Hadley's kind of persona to be portrayed as in the film. And so, guys, that brings it to an end. That was the list. Um, it's been an amazing production experience. All of these actors have been wonderful to work with. And we're excited for you guys to see this film in August. So, hit up your local theaters because a separate piece is coming to town. Pre-orders open today. Get them before they're gone.